I can never take this life I have for granted With all I've been through, it's crazy I'm still in it I mean I almost lost my life about a week ago To think that I'll be gone forever really hurt my soul Lord almost, uh, best that whole intro up So today we're going to be reacting to Bill Burr I haven't did Bill Burr in a while and I love him so far I already love him This is Bill Burr, why men are paid more than women And I'm about to go ahead and start screen recording in 3, 2, 1 Let's go ahead and push through. All right, thank you. Thanks a lot. How's it going? Great. It's nice to be here. I'm at that age where everybody I know is getting married. Let me ask you a question. Why the hell do people keep getting married? You know what I mean? Isn't anybody looking at the stats? You know what I mean, three out of four marriages go right down the shitter, right? If you were going skydiving and they told you three out of four parachutes weren't going to open, you'd be like, yo, fuck that, I'm not going. <laughs> like, That's I true, like I not odds. I have a 75% chance of splatting on the ground. But there's something about getting married. People just have to do it, right? They're just like, is this the line to lose half my shit? Awesome. <laughs> This is going to be great. No, I'm just kidding. I love women. I'm just not compatible with them. No, they got too much energy for me. You know what I said? They always have to be doing something. You know, like they can't like take a day off, you know? You can't have a day off when you have a girlfriend. They just like see that open day. They're like, oh my God, let's fucking fill it up with shit. Nice. Oh, it's kind of true. I told you lie. They just come at you with like one horrible idea after another. They have the worst ideas. They do. You ever get to this one, they'll be like, you want to go to brunch? You want to go to brunch on Sunday? And inside you're like, fucking no. But you can't say that. You got to keep her happy, right? So what do you do? You agree? Yeah, let's go to brunch. What a great idea. Why would you want to sleep in on a Sunday when you can go pay $52 for eggs? Now you're thinking. <laughs> then we can sit around and listen to your friends have moronic conversations about the eggs. You know, like, is that pesto? <laughs> is that pesto in your omelet? <laughs> oh, it's asparagus. I can't stand it. It's you. asparagus. <laughs> I thought it was pesto. Is that pesto? <laughs> I was dating this girl recently. She was like really into like women's issues, you know? Because women always go on TV, you know, they say all they want is to be treated exactly like guys. But if you listen to them, they don't. All they want is the good shit of being a guy. They're cherry picking. They look at a guy's life like it's like a buffet, right? Like you just can start picking out stuff, like same amount an hour, we'll take some of that. Pay for the movie, fuck that. You can keep that one, I don't like that one. This is nice, that's yucky, that's icky. Hey, come on, people, you can't choose. This girl gives me shit. She goes, well, why does a guy make more an hour to do the exact same job? I go, I'll tell you why. Because in the unlikely event that we're both on a Titanic and it starts to sink, for some fucked up reason, you get to leave with the kids and I have to stay. <laughs> That's why I get a dollar more an hour. That is not... Oh, it's a dollar oh. an hour. You hear a bump in the night, I gotta go check it out. Like, yes, he does have a knife. <laughs> Anytime there's a hostage situation, who do they negotiate for? Well, at least let the women and children go. Well, what about me? You think I want to stay in the vault? It's messed up. It's messed up because they would, they would for sure be like, F y'all, save the kids and the woman. You know, That's true. sweaty guys sharing a bag of peanuts, you know? Praying to God I'm not the hostage who gets dragged out by the psycho with a gun to my head as he's asking the cops for a helicopter. Which I know he's not gonna get, right? I know he's not getting the helicopter. So now I gotta make idle conversation with the 38 to my head going, dude, go for a rent a car. I think you should go for the rent a car. <laughs> See what I'm saying? Where are all those feminists then? You can't find them. There are no feminists in a house fire. You can take the most hardcore feminist, you know, some chick right in your face, you chauvinistic son of a bitch, you know, little short, little haircut, you know. Second those flames break out, she'll twist those little hairs into pigtails. Oh, I'm just a girl. I want to go play jump rope. <laughs> no, 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 no. no, 
Oh, that's why I hated that movie, The, uh, the Titanic. Every girl I meet thinks that movie's romantic. It's irritating. I think, that was really romantic, don't you think? It's like, no! It's a fucking horror film. <laughs> and they're always like, why? I'm like, because all the guys die. <laughs> See, you're watching it, trying to relate, going, who would I be? You'd be that chick floating away in the big piece of luggage, right? <laughs> I'm watching it, going, who would I be? I'd be that dude when, like, the boat breaks in half, that dude who, like, falls straight down and bangs off the shit and goes in the water. <laughs> That's who I'd be. I'd be wearing a tuxedo, not because I wanted to, but you wanted to dress up that night, right? <laughs> I'd be falling. I'd be falling the whole way down, going, I should have fucked that chicken first class. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I'm out of time. You guys are a lot of fun. Thank you very much. Good night. Thank you. Let me stop the screen recording. Oh, good Lord. When he started talking about, when he said, I mean, I, can, I don't want to say that because I don't want to piss nobody off, but I definitely understood his points. I'm not going to lie. His points made a lot of sense. You know, I guess it is like a kind of like pick and choose type of situation, but that's funny. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love Bill Burr so much. You have no idea. I really love him. I hope one day I can meet him and just hug him and tell him thank you for making me laugh. Because, man, um, make sure you guys like, comment, and share, and I will see you guys next video. Bye. When I can't sleep at night, got all these dreams to fight. I know it's angels on my back, but I can't see the light. Got all these demons on me, I know they scheming on me. Heard a shout coming from the distance, the reaper screaming for me. Yeah, but I got purpose, so I can't go. I know the devil cursed my.